Hey guys, it's Marissa. Bam! And today I'm here with... Daniel! Yay! <laughs> so, he has a little YouTube channel. You should check it out. We should all <laughs> spam him with embarrassing comments. <laughs> He's my best friend. And today we're filming a school-related BuzzFeed quiz-taking session. That made no sense. Just go with it. So, Dan knows how much I am obsessed with taking BuzzFeed quizzes, oh, and yes. he loves doing them too. Yes. <laughs> like, whenever I finish my assignment, I'm like, what do I do now? BuzzFeed quizzes. Yes. So, I found some school-related ones, and we're gonna take them. Funny backstory on me and Dan's friendship. <laughs> when I first met him, I thought he was the most annoying person ever, and I did not want to hang out with him. Yeah. At all. But he was like the only, he had the only open seat on the bus, so I was stuck with him. Yes. And look where we are now, best friends. <laughs> that was like, what, five, six years ago? Yeah, like beginning of uh, fifth grade. Yeah. Yeah, crazy. I think that just means I'm stuck with you now. I know. <laughs> it sucks to be you. The first one we're going to do is go school shopping at Target, and we'll guess your favorite subject. I'm going to link all of these quizzes down below, so you can take them yourself and put in the comments what you got. Fun. Which backpack do we like the best, Dan? I don't know. You have more fashion sense than I do. So. It's true. <laughs> I'm debating between the light pink one and then the blue. Or the light blue one. I apparently don't know my colors. Every color is pink to me. Yeah. <laughs> just different shades of pink. <laughs> Everything. That'd be the best color blind or whatever ever. Okay. Oh my gosh. I want everything to be pink. Okay, that's a little far. But I mean, you are obsessed with I the color pink. pink, so... <laughs> yep, my room looks like pink exploded. Yes. Alright, so pick between the dark blue one and the light blue uh, one. Uh, I mean, I like- I really like the dark blue. Right? Yeah. Alright, we'll pick the dark blue one. We'll pick the dark blue one, okay. okay. Pick a binder. I've broken all of those. I'm debating between the plain red one or this one, the colors. Hmm. The plain red one is boring. Exactly. Your geometric, ge ge geometric, geometric. Yes. <laughs> I was trying to say geometrical, which isn't a word. No. Geometric. Pick some pencils. Colorful mechanical ones. Yes. Poppy. I mean, they'll get lost in my locker in a week. But <sighs> pick a pencil case. Does that one say heck yes? I think so. Oh my gosh, we're picking heck yes. Okay. <laughs> I just vetoed. I was like, whatever you want. Mm. Pick a notebook. I get used to it. Pick a notebook. I like all of them. Well, there's one that's very sparkly. So, I'm guessing that one is the one. Oh yeah. Pick a lunch bag. Oh, with the other, a uh, ge geometrical one? Geometrical. <laughs> I thought it was a word! <laughs> oh, I know. It's gonna haunt you forever now. Like, are those- what? That's an eraser? That's not an eraser, that's a pencil. Yeah, it's a pencil. Okay. Oh, it's one of those. Oh. I like the big ones because I like to draw pictures. Pick something random. I thought that was an Etch-a-Sketch and I got really excited. <laughs> I just saw the word sketch and I was like, <gasps> Etch-a-Sketch? Yes. Those neon rainbow folders. Yeah. Okay, rainbow folders. <laughs> Favorite subject, gym. Hmm. I mean, not quite. Last year's gym. You're athletic, energetic, and you love, and you are, I can't read. You are an amazing team player. You love to try new things and challenge yourself and continue improving your endurance and athleticism. People love your enthusiasm, leadership ability, and phenomenal team spirit. Are you sure that's not mine? I was going to say, that's definitely <laughs> you. I don't know. I'm going to do, can we guess what grade you're in based on the school supplies you buy? Because I'm going to get, uh, like, kindergarten. Oh, yeah. Pick okay. a backpack. Uh, duh, I'm going to pick of LC. Why do all the folders look the same to me? These look more brightly colored. Mm hmm Pencils. Um, I'm gonna choose these colorful ones. I'm a kindergartner. <laughs> Pick some pens. Paper mate pens. Oh my gosh, I'd die for paper mate pens. They're nice. Same. I love them. Highlighters. <gasps> these highlighters have monsters on them. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, that's so cute. Crayons. I don't like crayons because I always wrote too hard with crayons and they just snapped in half every time I tried to draw with them. Same. What notebook do I want? Obviously, I want the shiny ones. Of I course. think those are folders though, like straight up. Oh no, they're notebooks. <gasps> wow. I'm blind. 
composition notebooks. I hate composition notebooks because they don't stay open, so I bought all spiral notebooks, even though for math class, I think you're supposed to have a composition notebook. Well, you were supposed to have one of those last year, but nobody did. Yeah. That's what I thought. I was like, I remember people having like all sorts of folders or bind notebooks. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. I remember people having all sorts of notebooks and nobody really caring. So yeah. I decided to go with spiral because I hate composition. Yeah. I'm going to choose uh, these galaxy like ones. <gasps> Wait, you are. Ah! It said you got, you're in 10th grade. <laughs> Wait, even with the, di not dinosaur, wow, monster, monster highlighters. highlighters. BuzzFeed knows too much. We have to shut him down. <laughs> oh wait, they thought you were going to yell. Ha! <laughs> Anna, right? Hey, I thought you said I could make it. Yes, Daniel. You can go to Yale. Now this one I feel like was made for you. How well will you do in school this year based on the day you spent in college? Tomorrow's the big day. What time are you going to set your alarm for? I'm not setting an alarm. I'm not going to college. You wake up and your first class starts in 10 minutes. What do you do? Nothing. <laughs> I hate that these are actual options in the quiz. Dan's getting what he wants. Oh, yes. You finally make it to class. Oh. Where are you sitting? By the door. It's time for lunch. What you doing? <laughs> Definitely not finding a quiet place to eat while studying. Ugh. Probably getting lunch downtown so I can leave school. You have an hour until your next class. What you gonna do? Take a nap. What are you doing for dinner? Eat noodles in my dorm room. <laughs> You're invited to a party. What do you do? Go without hesitating. At the end of the night, you crawl into bed and check your phone. What time is it? 1 a.m. Yeah, damn. Mm. You got, you're gonna get by. You're gonna pass all of your classes, but not without a bump or three in the road. Here's to a great year. Or three, you mean, or 23. Well, tomorrow's the big day. What time are you gonna set your alarm? 7 a.m., bright and early. You wake up and your first class starts in 10 minutes. What do you do? I'm gonna throw random clothes on and sprint to class. That's what I do. I did it today. I woke up, or I didn't wake up, but I forgot to set my alarm, and I was like setting things up for this collab before I went to work. And then I looked at my phone, and I was like, ah! And I like ran. I was like, gotta get to work. Yeah. You finally make it to class. Where are you sitting? I mean, I wouldn't want to sit in the first row. I'd want to sit in the second row. So should I just pick first row anyway? Because I wouldn't want to sit in the middle because I fear I'd be too far because I don't have the best eyesight or hearing. But I mean, it says somewhere in the middle. So you could be like. That's true. Like I'm in the second row. Yeah, somewhere in the middle. Yeah. Because I don't want to be in first row. Oh, no. Because then if I ever take BuzzFeed quizzes, they're going to be like. Yeah, I did that during English, and uh, the teacher sent an email to my mom. It's time for lunch. What are you doing? I'm going to get lunch downtown, too. There's an option that says grab a friend and head to the nearest dining hall. And I would eat with a friend, but I wouldn't want to eat in the dining hall, because I would want to go downtown. You have an hour until your next class. What are you going to do? Um, I'd probably watch videos on YouTube. What are you doing for dinner? Get food with a friend. I would never text a group chat because it's too hard to set up plans with that many friends. Oh, yeah. You're invited to a party. What would you go? I'd go without hesitating. And I'd drag you with me. I'd be like, we're going to a party. That's why I said I would go without hesitating. Mm -hmm. At, it's the end of the night. You crawl into bed and check your phone. What time is it? 11 p.m. I mean, really, it'd be like 10 to 12. <sighs> oh no! I got, you're going to have an emotional roller coaster of a school year. This year is going to be quite a ride. You might have a rough relationship or end a friendship. Ah! Not us. Not us. Hopefully. But karma will kick in and you'll have some amazing times as well. This one has Girl Meets World in the picture, so obviously oh. we have to take that one. Girl Meets World is like our show. When they took it off of Netflix, I legit almost cried. Yeah. Because I was like, oh, I'm going to go watch Girl Meets World. I haven't watched it in forever. Throwback. Oh. And then I was like. <sighs> yeah, you see, I don't have Netflix. Yeah. Are you going to be getting the new Disney streaming service when it comes out? No. Really? Next, we're going to do buy seven school supplies at Target, and we'll guess your favorite school subject. We already did this one, but this one has a Girl Meets World in the picture, so we're doing it. Pick a backpack. I'm picking the purple one. Pick a notebook. I'm picking pink. the pink one. Some pens. Why don't they have Papermate pens? I'm gonna click 
Gelosity, because I like gel pens. I think that's what those were. Pick some pencils. These look like the pens. Oh, aren't those like the fancy ones? Yeah, the ones that you find in the hall. And yeah. You don't really buy. Yep, 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 yep. Oh my gosh, pick a lunch bag. This one is shiny. Pick an art supply. I'm trying to decide between Sharpies and washable markers. I would always steal Caitlyn's Sharpies in math class and draw on everything. Like, I drew on Alex's arms all the time. I would just be like, he's like, you want to draw something on my arm? I was like, yes. I'm going to click Sharpies. Pick one other item. I'm going to go with binder. Art. No, I don't like art. I barely got through art class with an A. Most of my time in art, I had a B, so I had to redo pretty much every assignment so that he would give me extra points. Well, I have to keep my 4.0, Dana. I know, I have to keep my 2.5. I've decided we're doing one more. Okay. I can't stop. See my obsession now, I bet. And the last quiz we're gonna take is how normal are your school subject preferences? Because I'm a huge nerd and Dan doesn't like anything school related. <laughs> So this is Except be for fun. gym and leaving. <laughs> Which subject is better, math or science? <gasps> oh no! Well, technically, science is math. So therefore, the correct answer to this is math. Oh! 63% uh, of people chose science and 37 chose math. Which subject is better, English history? English all the way. History is the most boring thing ever in the world. Nothing makes sense. Too many dates to memorize. 55% of people chose English and 45 chose history. Wow, that was almost even split. Well, I mean, there are some cool facts about nope. history. subject is better. Biology or chemistry? Biology, so much. 65% of people agree with me. Which subject is better? Art or PE? I'm gonna go art. Yeah, 70 people agree okay. art. Okay, 30% of people, come on. Should be more. Okay, let's be real. Any sporty people who like PE aren't taking BuzzFeed quiz. Most of them are. Except for you. Okay, what subject is better? Algebra or physics? Algebra. Oh yeah. 65% Sixty-five percent of people agreed with you. You sounded like a robot. Sixty-five percent of people agree. I'm Siri, guys. Which subject is better? Psychology, sociology. What's the difference? Psychology is brain stuff. I think. Well, I'll go with that one. Yeah, 73 percent. Hey. It might have just been that everyone was like me and was like, what does that mean? And just click the first option like me. <laughs> Which subject is better? Creative word, writing creative writing. No <laughs> literature. Creative writing or literature. I'm gonna go literature, because that's reading, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and then the poet of me pops out like creative writing. Which I stopped doing poetry. Forty-four percent of people agreed with me. I don't it was I love creative writing and I love literature, so I could have gone either way. Yeah. Which subject is better? Government or geology? Let's see. Dumb stuff or dumb stuff? Oh. And I, I'm gonna go with geology. Yeah. Government is not. Really? 51% of people chose government. No way. That's it for that quiz. Thanks for coming along and taking quizzes yeah, with no me. Problem. And being on my YouTube channel. Yeah. Hi. Hi, how are you? Oh my oh god. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like for guests. Comment down below what other back to school videos you'd like me to do. And also, comment down below. English or history, we know the correct answer. English. History. English. History. English. History. English. History. We're going to continue this argument. <laughs> yes. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye.